Hello guys, in this tutorial let's learn about acid rain. Acid rain, I hope everyone heard this word, but most of us don't know what originally acid rain is. Okay, now you'll be learning it. The phenomena of acid rain involves the combination of atmospheric water drops with air pollutants which combines to fall as an acid rain. I hope you understood now a bit of idea. Okay, let's go through another definition. Uh, example of acid rain, causes of acid rain. Acid rain contains mainly sulfuric acid, carbonic acid, nitric acid produced from fossil fuels combustion in the car engines and power plants. Okay, I hope everyone got, everyone of you got a small idea on what is acid rain. Acid rain is nothing but whenever there is a rainfall and there is a lots and lots of pollution due to gases or industries or somehow and if those water molecules combine with these gases then they are going to form acid rain okay i think everyone is clear now with acid rain okay acid rain if if you want to know what are the chemicals included what are how are those chemicals formed okay it is formed due to sulfur dioxide Sulfur dioxide combines with oxygen to form sulfur trioxide and when our sulfur trioxide mixes with water it causes sulfuric acid which is really a dangerous gas sorry dangerous acid sorry guys it is a dangerous acid and nitrogen mixing with oxygen gives nitrous oxide and nitrous oxide plus ozone gives nitrogen dioxide and nitrogen dioxide with water gives nitric acid this is also an acid a dangerous acid next carbon dioxide plus water gives carbonic acid this is also an acid and this is also an acid so hence acid rain is have consists mainly of acids even the word says that acid rain rain of acids okay guys i hope everyone got a small idea on this let us go through some causes it includes volcanic eruptions natural causes will be volcanic eruptions and lightnings Whenever there is a huge rain, we will be seeing some thunders and lightnings. Those are also the causes of acid rain. And anthropogenic causes or human man-made causes will be rapid industrialization, burning of coal and burning of fossil fuels. The most main problems in our society is these three guys. Industrialization and production while production of electricity and burning of fossil fuels. Okay. Some impacts. Impact is nothing but causes of acid rain it causes damage to human health we'll be getting lung disorders asthma nervous system problems and many other things it also causes damage to land as soil erosion okay and loss of minerals there will be many minerals and nutrients missing okay just a second guys okay. uh -huh. acid rain Runoffs cause acidification of rivers, lakes. Yeah, if this acid rain directly or indirectly travels into a river or a stream, if it mixes with those water bodies, it is going to cause lots and lots of diseases and it forms really a toxic water. Hence, mixing like this is really, really dangerous and it can also melt metals and form toxic metals metal liquid something like that okay what are the preventive measures okay we need to use the clean form of fuels like we can also run vehicles using biogas which is not at all pollution which not at all causes any pollution so use less energy hence less fuel fuels will be burnt use clean fuel Remove oxides of sulfur and nitrogen before releasing because sulfurs, nitrogen and carbonates, carbons, these three are the main causes for acid rain. Follow, reduce, reuse, recycle, that will also be a use. Okay guys, I hope everyone got an idea on acid rains. So in the next tutorial, we'll be learning about ozone layer depletion. Thank you guys. Thanks for watching.